Facing the fall, the Florida Education Association's lawsuit to keep the state from forcing school districts to open classrooms has survived its first legal hurdle. Today, a judge denied the governor's motion to dismiss the suit. As News 4 Jax reporter Mike Vasilenda tells us, both sides have now been ordered to try to settle the case, and if they can't, the judge will begin hearing arguments. The state argued that not dismissing the case would invalidate the choice of Florida's parents who weren't being represented in court. Parents of 1,600,000 students have decided they want to go. Roughly 1,400,000 have decided they don't want to go. There have been more than 8,300 COVID cases in kids under 18 since the beginning of August. 100 have been hospitalized. The teachers union told the judge he was facing a life or death decision for both students and teachers. And school districts are being pressured uh, with this zeal to open schools uh, without regard for the continuing expansion of the pandemic. There is a clear and present danger of children and teachers and support staff in our school system. Circuit Judge Charles Dobson wasted no time saying his hands were tied by procedure. I'm denying the motion to dismiss. By denying the motion to dismiss, I'm not in any way saying that the plaintiffs are going to be successful with their case. The judge has ordered both sides to sit down and try and negotiate a settlement. And the union's hope is that the state will agree to let each school district decide when it's safe to open in-person learning without facing the loss of state funding. And if the case doesn't settle, it will be back in court Wednesday morning when the judge will be asked to let local school districts decide when it's safe to send kids back to the classroom without the fear of losing a portion of their state funding. Reporting for the state capitol, Mike Vasilinda, Channel 4, the local station. More than a dozen school districts opened this week. A dozen more, including Duval County, will open next week with the rest opening by the end of the month.